was an interesting little puzzle that I was way overthinking, I think. Like, as soon as I realized that the only one that pushed two in together, I really should have realized that was the solution. Uh, where do I want to go now? I don't think I can go through that door. That's like on the bottom right. I think that's a helmet lock or a lock from the other side. Okay, well, I need to think, I need to think of what do I know how to do right now. As it is, I know how to do a couple of things. There's the tiger room, which I'm like 80% sure I understand at this point, but I also am equally as sure that I'm missing part of it. There's the masks, which are also kind of like, I know what those are for, but I don't know where the rest of it is. And there's, I have the wind crest, which I don't know what that's for. I've got like three octagonal indentations, two on the door here in the foyer and one on that quote unquote unexplored room on the north. And then there's the music sheets. Honestly, out of everything I have at my disposal, I think the music is the one thing that I have the highest odds of being able to do something with. So let's do it. Also, I was very wrong on my prediction with that painting being tied to that night room. That night room was its own beast. Okay, that, that dude is kind of freaking me out. That guy is new and dangerous. Well, this is the room I want to eventually go to. I couldn't, I was trying to go through the other door, but it wasn't letting me go. Like, I need to get to the typewriter. Okay, oh, I hate to do this but I feel like that guy is gonna hit hard enough to kill me, and I don't wanna take that chance. At full health, I think I might be able to survive a hit. Da -da 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 I can't go through that door, it's shaking. Run, run, run! <sighs> okay. He was not there before. We had a shuffler before, now we've got a Claw monster. Unless he is the same dude and he's just grown stronger. Oh, jeez. Please tell me that's not the case. That's horrifying if that's the case. I do not know why. But that is like the first enemy to legitimately scare me. Like. Just something about the way it looked legitimately makes me uncomfortable. More so than the other monsters we faced. <sighs> oh, hello. Uh, I want to look at that door and go downstairs. But you're kind of in my way. Shooting is a bad idea. <laughs> uh, this door is helmet, right? <sighs> okay. What do I have right now? Well, let's put this away. Take Moonlight Sonata. And I still feel like the wooden mount is going to be important. Okay. So from here, I need to go back upstairs and go back the way I came. And hopefully I won't die in the process. I could save, but I genuinely don't feel much of a need to right now. 
I haven't done that much, and I think I could solve that night puzzle again pretty easily if I had to redo it. Alright, come on. I need you to get around me. You know what? Maybe I... Oh, there's there's two of you. I, there's three... Oh, Jesus, bad. Okay, this just got to be a bit of a problem. I do not have the resources to handle three zombies in this room. This is why I want to clear these. Oh, man. I also just took some more damage, so I'm going to need to heal. Take that first aid spray. I'm not going to use it yet, but I am going to take it. Hopefully I don't need the wooden mount for the piano room. Is there another way for me to get back from here? Yes. Okay. Shuffles, go away. I got enough to worry about right now. Okay, I can ignore you. Oh, hi. That's not something that's quite easy to ignore. <laughs> Tiger room. Still need the blue gem for that. And that's in my box. I just don't have it with me. Excuse me. Coming through. And goodbye. Wait, I have to get past him. Crap. I gotta get past Claw Man. Because that's where the piano is. It's the door behind him. All right, here we go. Okay, that worked. Somehow. <laughs> I don't know how, but I'm not gonna complain. All right, Moonlight Sonata. No, not that, this. Thank goodness I didn't need to wooden mount for this. Secret door. Another emblem? Gold emblem. And I get locked in the room. I know what I need to do. I need to take the wooden emblem from the fireplace and use that as a decoy. Also, what's this? Trevor's Diary. November 24th, 1967. Eleven days have passed since arriving on this estate. How did I end up like this? A guy in a lab coat brought me a meager plate of food and said, Sorry to put you through this, but it's for security reasons. That's when it hit me. It all makes sense now. There are only two people that know the secret of this mansion. Sir Spencer and myself. If they kill me, Sir Spencer will be the only person that knows the secret. But for what purpose? It doesn't matter now. It's too dangerous here. My family. I hope they're all right. I've decided to escape. Jessica, Lisa, I pray you are safe. November 26, 1967. How could I be so careless? I lost my favorite lighter, the one Jessica gave me for my birthday. Now it's going to be that much harder to escape this dark place. November 13th, the date when my fate was sealed. My aunt was hospitalized just three days before that. Jessica and Lisa said that they were going to visit her. I wish I could be there with them. But wait, even as I'm writing, my memory is coming back to me more vividly. Just before I passed out, I remember the men in the lab coat said something like, Most likely your family is already. I pray for their safety. November 27th, 1967. Somehow I managed to get out of that room, but getting out of this mansion won't be as easy. I have to get past all the booby traps. 
Tiger eyes. Gold emblem. I have to try and remember for my own sake. Interesting. So someone named Treasure. Tr treasure. Trevor was trapped here. Why am I going this way? Allegedly by the owner of the mansion, the Sir Spencer. We've seen that name a couple of times. Come to think of it. Ow. Um. Run, 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 run. Uh, come to think of it, as I was going to say, I don't know when this game takes place. Like, time frame wise. Okay. We're going to take this emblem, and you know what? That dude is going to be a major pain. I'm going to try and get rid of him. We're going to fight. Come here, claw man. Yoink. Ouch. Ouch. Oh, come on. All right. Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not. I couldn't even get a shot off on him. If I had the shotgun with me, with some ammo in it, I would have probably fared a little bit better. Oh geez, I'm in the major red now. I'm gonna need to find some herbs. Okay, let's go ahead and fit this emblem. And now I have the gold emblem. That being said, I have virtually no idea what to do with it. The only thing I can think to do is put it where the wooden emblem was. But I'm not exactly sure what that'll do for me, you know what I mean? Get your crappy hands away from me! Yeah, I really need to get my hands on the shotgun shells and kill that guy. Okay, so, can I put this in here? Yes. Hello? I don't know what I was expecting, but it wasn't this. When the two have run each other through, the path to your destiny will open. It looks like you can turn the gears inside the clock. So I can turn the small gear or the large gear. Currently, the minute hand is on the helmet, and the hour hand is on the armor. If I turn the small gear left. Oh, oh! Never mind. Let's try turning them both to sword. Oh, wait. One has a sword going through the chest, the other has a sword going through a hel hel his head. So let's turn the large gear. Wait! Wait, 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 hold on. Let me reread this. The short sword is in the chest, the long sword is in the head. The hour hand goes to the armor, the minute hand goes to the helmet. That's what that means. Small gear, left. So the minute hand is where it needs to be. I just need to get the hour hand. There. Nope. There we go. Get that! Another key! Mansion key. An engraving of a shield. I remember seeing one shield lock. Literally one. Okay. 
I need to heal badly. So I am going to go to those green herbs on the balcony and patch up before I go and do anything else. How much space do I have? I have one inventory slot. I think after that... Hmm. I don't know. I'm trying to think if there's any other locked doors I haven't tried. Because I still kind of want to use the armor key until it's gone, you know? I want the armor key to just die. So that way it's out of my inventory, but also because, it, but because it's unneeded. It bugs me that I haven't been able to do that yet. Green herbs. Oh, that feels better. Okay. Helmet. Helmet. So both those are helmet. That one's helmet. The one in the unexplored room, that's neither. Downstairs, I think it said locked from the other side. I... I don't remember what that one said, but it wasn't... I don't think it was armor. So it's either that stairs one on the bottom right. Although I think that one might have been the shield one. It could be that other one in the room not too far from me, but I think that was locked from the other side. Or it could be the one up there. You know, I'm on this side of the mansion. I might as well check. Can't hurt, right? Okay, so from here. It's not that one. But I'm here. I should check. Get your grabby hands away from me. Yeah, that's helmet. That's what I thought. That's helmet. Ah, dang it. Try to dance past him. It didn't work. Okay, where am I going? Back this way. Ah, jeez. You're just gonna make this annoying, ain't ya? I need to go around. This door. So, let's check here. Other side, that's what I thought. Oh, come on! Oh, that's not good. Oh, I'm dead! Oh, jeez, that's another claw monster, too. Oh, man. I don't even remember what the last time I saved was. I don't remember what the last thing I did was. Shoot! Just to be clear, this is a helmet lock, right? No, it's not. That's been an armor lock this whole time. Oh, my lord. That was the last key use of the armor. I'm a doggone idiot. Okay, well, um, new room, new room, a table made of glass, neat. As an aside, it looks like I haven't actually done as much as I was afraid I had done when I died. The main thing I had to redo was the night puzzle and I've still got to do the clock puzzle in the kitchen or the dining room. Why do I keep calling it a kitchen? It's not a kitchen. Hello. Hello. Forrest has given up the ghost. It looks like he's been dead for a while. I guess he was a companion of ours. A companion who brought a grenade launcher. A companion who is now getting up and is probably gonna try and kill us. Oh geez, you're fast. Come on. All right, hold on. 
I'm gonna equip the knife and use my mixed herbs. Stab, stab, stab. Bad ideas, bad ideas. Okay, he's gonna run. Ah, oh, come on, I wasn't close enough. Give it a stab. Give it a stab. I'm gonna die. Oh, man. Okay, then. I'm gonna go back there. And he's gonna get shot with his own grenade launcher. Oh, hello. I just decided to fiddle around with the jewelry box. Apparently, I was mistaken on what each of those things were. Okay. I now have three of the masks. Wow, way to interrupt my jubilant moment. It, it, yeah, it, it just, I don't know why, but that time it just occurred to me, you know, I didn't actually look at every single side of that box. Some of the, uh, you know, some of them said they had switches on them. I was like, maybe there's switches on the other ones that actually would do something. And sure enough, there was. <laughs> I just completely misinterpreted the meaning of the box. Better late than never, I suppose. Well, I only need one more mask for the puzzle down in that area. So I guess... I guess I'll take this first aid spray with me. Mm. Yeah, I'll just take it. Um, I guess it's back over to uh, Forrest and his uh, grenade launcher. All right, take the launcher, equip the launcher, move over here, take that herb, use it so that I can survive a bite. All right, number one, first aid spray. Number two, run this way. Number three, boom! Boom! I think I missed with that first shot. Oh well. This room ain't done apparently. I don't want him to come back. I say I don't want him to come back. I guess he's not coming back. Works for me then. A plant that's been damaged by exposure to the elements. Ooh, a dagger! Yeah, baby. Let's go. Get a knife. Okay, so I still need to do the puzzle in the dining room slash bar room. But now I have a grenade launcher. Which means I can take out Mr. Claw Man in the hallway that goes in between the two rooms. And I've still got my one unit of kerosene left, so I can use that as well. So let's start off by getting the emblem, since I know I'm gonna need it. Wait, do I have space? I do, I have one space. Good, one space is all I freaking need. Here we go. Take the emblem.
Go in here. And get ready to shoot. Hello? I don't understand it, but I'm not questioning it. You are gone. I feel at peace. Whew. Okay. So now that that's done. It's not necessary to use this. N I wasn't close enough to the dang piano. Play that note, Jill. Take the golden emblem. The door closed. Use this emblem. The door open. Pick up the book. It's a book with quite a story in it. And it seems like that the tiger eye statue might be important for something. This is giving me a key, the emblem, right? But we're still missing the helmet key. What if that's what the tiger eyes are for? That would make sense. Because both of them would be giving a statue, uh, giving a key. Both of them are mentioned in the journal. Plus, helmet, tiger head. It just makes sense. I bet that's what you get. But first things first. Let's get that shield key. Besides, I'm still, I'm, I'm, I'm still convinced I'm missing a gem. All right, so turn the gears. So the small gear turns the big hand. I don't want to do that hand. I want to do the big gear for the small hand. Large. Yes. Keep turning. Large. Left. At six o'clock, the key becomes clear. Shield key. Acquired. And I am pretty sure that that little tiny stairway door leads to a shield door. Think that that's where we use a shield key. The Lord, the transition is not kind there. <laughs> Ah. I should mention one of the reasons I'm having such a hard time with the screen transitions is because when it transitions, whatever direction I'm holding the key, the, the control stick in doesn't matter. It's whatever direction Jill is moving in, she keeps moving. So even though I'm holding down, she's moving forward. But whenever I see the transition, my brain just auto-corrects and makes me move the control stick in the direction that it looks like it's supposed to be, and that messes me up. <laughs> because my brain doesn't always move it in the right direction. When it doesn't need to move it at all. That, like, that's what happens every time I get stuck, like, flitting between transition screens like that. Hey, uh, hey uh, Richard, I believe your name was. How you doing? You seem, you still seem to be alive, which is surprising. Good luck keeping it that way. All right, so this is shield, right? Yep. And it's the only one. <laughs> it's the only use of that key. Ugh. That door looks like it's seen better days. As does this whole room. Holy crap, this is a dusty... Hi! Richard! Good thing I got the grenade launcher. Ooh. Yeah, not, ne 
messing around with no giant snack. Dang it, Richard dies a freaking hero! Richard! Oh, and the snake's not done. I am out of big gun. Down to little gun. Wait, what's this? The final mask! Okay, so, uh, giant snake just kind of came and went. That's not good. Richard, what's this? Assault shotgun? <laughs> Excuse me? Fires 12 gauge shells. Stars custom arsenal and also Richard's favorite. I should also examine this gun. A gun that fires grenade rounds, acid rounds, or incendiary rounds. Pretty standard on that one. I was not expecting to get a super shotgun effectively. I wonder if it uses the same ammo or not. It says it fires custom rounds, but I don't know. Either way, poor Richard, man. I was not expecting him to go out a freaking hero like that, but. He done did his due diligence. Okay, well, I think after that event, I need to save. Um, fastest way is the other way. You jerk! Get stabbed! I heard a door open. And I don't like that I heard a door open. Luckily, this room is safe, guaranteed. Oh yeah, did I? I did, I did use all the kerosene. Okay. So, before I save, I'm gonna do a little bit of uh, organization. Also, how's my health? I'm fine, okay, we're fine. We're full health somehow. So, I'm gonna put this away for the moment. And this. And the knife. Maybe, mm, no, I don't know. Okay, I am gonna put the knife away for the moment. But that's because the next thing we're gonna be doing is putting the masks in. Grab the ribbon. We're gonna save the game. Actually, wait. Refill my fuel. Now we'll save. And just as well, this is where I need to call it for the moment. I've been going for about three hours now. And next time on Resident Evil, we're gonna take the masks to the graveyard See what it unlocks. Hopefully a path to the helmet key. Thanks so much for watching. Goodbye.